for CNET at CES 2014, taking a first look at the Panono panoramic ball camera, taking selfies to a whole new level. So what you do is you throw this camera up into the air with two hands. It takes a photo as it reaches the highest point, a 360 degree interactive panorama. That's all comes down to those 36 cameras that are dotted all around this ball's surface. Altogether, you're getting a photo with 108 megapixels of resolution, making it the highest resolution consumer-based camera on the market. Now, as you can see, I have two models in front of me. This is the final retail version that you can pick up if you pre-order from Indiegogo. As you can see, it's a much smaller model than the prototype, which is right here. It's made of tough and plastic, so if you're a bit of a klutz like me, you can drop it and it doesn't matter all too much. So, this is the prototype, obviously a lot bigger, and when you throw this one up into the air, it captures the panoramic image. Once you have this image, what you can do is you see the unstitched version. As you can see on the screen here, this is the unstitched version before it goes to the servers and it presents you with a stitched version. Also, what you can do with your 360 degree panorama is view it on a smartphone or tablet and interact with the image by pointing the tablet in a certain direction and you can see that particular portion of the image. So the Panono panoramic ball camera will be available for $4.99 on Indiegogo coming very soon. I'm Lexi Savides for CNET and this has been a first look of the Panono panoramic ball camera.